Hey everybody, welcome back. You know on this channel we compare a lot of things with life in Taiwan and life in North America. Today it's a pretty easy one. Taiwan clearly wins the comparison today. We're going to be talking about something that you love in Taiwan. It's always open. It's 7-Eleven. Now in North America we have 7-Elevens too, of course. But they're not nearly as good as what you all have in 7-Eleven. However, there still are a few things in our 7-Elevens here that you might not see in Taiwan 7-Eleven. So I thought I'd have us take a look at some of those things today. Here we go. Get the uh, two Boston creams, two apple fritters, and two. Honey cruller. Sure. Anything else? Sir? That's it. Okay, guess where I am. I know you might be thinking Tim Hortons, but actually, this is 7-Eleven. 7-Eleven here has a drive-through and it has a Tim Hortons inside. So you can get your donuts and go to 7-Eleven all at the same time. You can buy gas here, fill it up, all at 7-Eleven. Now, as you can see, with all of the snow and the dirt on the road, the car's very dirty. We'll need to wash it. Welcome to our car wash. Please enter a code number. What's the code? Please wait. Wash and use. I'm going to show you how you can buy things using the app. When you come into 7-Eleven, you have everything on your phone and you can scan the products yourself and then it's linked to a credit card. You just link it, scan it, and you're done. You can see I have the app open here. And then you take your, let's say, oh, your Pao Mian, okay? Your Pao Mian. And then we go to mobile checkout, right there. Now you can see that it's got a barcode reader. So, oop, there it is. So I've already got the barcode in and it's going to look for it here. And I have my Pao Mian for $3.49, which seems like an awful lot for this one, but okay. And then we will check out. Now you can use Apple Pay or your credit card, okay, if you have a credit card. If you don't, just load up some cash into Apple Pay and you can use that. All right, so we're gonna use that one. And then we'll pay with the Touch ID. And we're good. Okay, now it says to confirm your purchase. And you just set it on top, here. And it turns green. <laughs> and mobile checkout, and there you go. See how that works? So this, and then this one. They have nothing like this in Taiwan. And I just put it in. And then, what else is good? Oh, like the jalapeno one. oh yeah, they have jalapeno. Jalapeno and cream cheese. Funny one, if you get the beef one, you can actually get nacho cheese and dip it in. Get one of these There's a small lid in there too. Oh, okay, so we have this. Taquitos and nacho, nacho cheese. cheese. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can choose their stuff. This is some of their made food. Okay. And we got two, one, and two. We got two of them. Okay. And we got a deal on it. They subtracted. Okay. So check out. And pay. This one is jalapeno. This is spicy. I don't like it. Ah, uh, okay. A little bit like uh, the very thin onion cake outside. 
that and this one I don't know what's inside let me see Is it's it good? like a Mexican food. Oh, dip it in the cheese. No, um, do you have cheese here? Mm -hmm. And then, mm, okay, eat it with cheese is better. Um, this would be a really good quick snack. Okay, here you can buy lottery tickets too. Here. Okay, so here you get a ticket. We're explaining this to our friends in Taiwan. Okay. Sorry, sorry, I, I, if you don't want to do it, it's fine. Okay. I understand, okay, thanks. <laughs> Their 7-Elevens are very, very different. Thanks a lot for your help. Hi, Taiwan. <laughs> Okay, there you go. Now, as you could probably tell, I didn't really know how to make a lottery ticket in the 7-Eleven because I've never really bought one before. But the people there were very helpful and they helped me to get a ticket. Let me show it to you here. Here it is. So you can kind of see these are the numbers here. Now the drawing... The drawing will be coming up soon. So if in our next video you see me all rich and happy, you know things went very well. Okay? All right. Those are just a few of the things that you can find in North American 7-Elevens that you might not see in Taiwan. I hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you again next time. Bye-bye!